All right, so you saw the thumbnail, you clicked on it, and you know I'm gonna be doing Subway sandwiches. So I got a bunch of Subway sandwiches here. I'm gonna try to eat them all I got, all, I, all that I got. I don't remember what I ordered for cut type, so I'll tell you, hopefully. No, I don't think it even says on the, we'll, we'll see if we can figure it out as we go. Cause I have no idea what any of these are. Anyways, geez, you'd think they'd put what type. Huh. All right, let's just get this started. Open this up. Kind of excited about this. I didn't have to cook them. Yeah, there's no label or anything. So this is looking like... Mm, it's like chicken salad, I think. I don't know. I'm sorry for not knowing what they are, but... Okay, let's start the clock. Hopefully that's in the frame. Yeah, Subway sandwich challenge. I'm gonna try to get, eat them all. I'm really excited about this. Didn't have to do any cooking. It's hot outside. These are not gonna hot. These aren't hot. So this, yeah, this looks like chicken. I don't remember getting chicken salad, but. It's baked, baked chicken, I think. Mmm. The bread was fresh too, because when I got there, he was still baking it. So this is really good. Something about getting a sandwich from a restaurant <clears throat> Than opposed to making it at home. I mean, I don't know. It always just seems better when you get it at like a pizza place or a fast food. I mean, the sandwiches seem better for some reason. Might be I'm just so bad at making sandwiches. All right, one down. Thumbs up on that one is really good. I think it was like baked, it was chicken breast, I think. And this one, oh, this looks like steak and cheese. All right, number three. And I get all my sandwiches not toasted. <clears throat> I like them better that way. This is, oh, meatball. All right, so meatball sandwiches at Subway are like very, very small. Not very satisfying. They taste good though. The, um, I like the sauce and the meatballs and there's just not a lot of them. So 
I would be a little disappointed if that was my lunch and I ordered more than one. So here's another meatball. Very tasty, but this is not a lot of to it. I gotta say the bread is very fresh though. <clears throat> very good on the bread. Wow, this one looks like it's got some weight to it, actually. This is pretty good. What is this? Um, it's like sweet chicken, I think. There's like a sweet ch Yeah, I think it's... Mm -hmm. Wow. They really loaded this one up. This is a really good one. I would recommend this one for sure. This isn't a food review, I'm just saying. I'd get this one again just because it has a lot of stuff in it. And it has pretty good flavor. I think it's been like 10 years or maybe even more since I've ever been to a Subway. I don't eat out that much. <laughs> All right. I think this one's number six. Oh, we pick up the pace here. What we got for time? Almost nine minutes. Oh, this one's got a lot of veggies. Um. Well, I think this is like the forest ham, black forest ham. Ton of veggies, not much ham. <laughs> I don't know, all these veggies, I'm gonna have to count this as a healthy challenge. All right. <clears throat> Cut six down. So far, pretty good. Not sure. <clears throat> Not sure of the variety here. Let's see. Might have some extra, the same ones over again. So this looks, oh, I think this is tuna. Mm -hmm. Wow, that tuna has a strong flavor. Mind you, back when I was in high school, I used to have a tuna fish sandwich every single day for lunch. Very 
Very tasty, strong flavor though. Ah, what is this? This is chicken breast, it looks like. Yeah, some kind of chicken breast. It has like the, the cheesy bread, I think you call it. I forget what you call the bread. It's a different type of bread. I felt bad. I, I put this big order in and he was over there working by himself. This bread is good. <clears throat> Five cheese bread, I think. I can't remember. Chicken breast is very tender though. Mm. Could have used a little mayor uh, mayonnaise on there or Miracle Whip, which I have sitting right here, which I forgot about. I didn't use again. I guess cheese must be extra because none of these have any cheese on them. I hope the last two I got are better than these. This is pretty good, but there's a little bit of turkey in here, but it's almost like eating a veggie sandwich, but not a lot of vegetables in it. Oh, man. I'm not a big fan of the, the bell peppers in there. Oh, this one looks like it's, I didn't say. Um, this one looks like it might be turkey and ham with a crap load of veggies. This is taking a lot longer than they thought it was. That was going to go in the I didn't count for all these vegetables to be on here. All right, what do we got here? another steak and cheese. I don't think there's any cheese though. Yeah. 
must be extra. I forgot, I didn't click on anything extra. Whoop. More bell pepper, but uh, nice having not all of the vegetables. So this tastes really good. Out of all the different types of food that you're gonna do a challenge with, I think sandwiches are the hardest challenge you can do. In terms of like eating a lot of them, I think like a 12 pound sandwich would be harder than eating a 12 pound pizza for sure. I wonder if anybody else agrees. Hmm. There's not a whole lot of 12 pound sandwich challenges. You got the big fat fatty, south side six, the gyros, I count those as sandwiches. Um, off the top of my head, that's the only ones I can think of that are that big. Hmm. There used to be a big, big cold, cold cut one. Um, uh, where was that? I think it was in like Washington State. There is cheese in this, it's all down the bottom. Mm. Good. Huh, all right. Last sandwich, feels like it has a decent amount of weight to it. So I'm guessing it's got a ton of veggies, unfortunately. Yep. And it looks, oh, it's that sweet chicken one again. Well, hopefully it tastes good, but it is got some weight to it. Hmm. It's funny now that you're, you're the last sandwich, you're not as hungry as you were when you did the other one. So it doesn't taste as good as when I first had it, but it's still good. All right, home stretch, last six inches of yeah, maybe honey chicken. Yeah. It's a lot of onion on that. All right, looking down there. Gotta say, Subway's chicken is very, very tender. Stop it at 31, 38, over 31 and a half minutes. Super duper slow for eating sandwiches, but let's try to enjoy them a little bit. I do have some cookies. These are not Subway cookies, though. These are some cookies I had sitting around, and they are super duper stale. So I'm just going to throw them away. When I got these, these were crunchy not so much <laughs> the 
And for some reason, they don't even taste like peanut butter anymore. Or very little. Anyways. Twelve somebody sandwiches. Super slow time. Mm. Out of all the sandwiches, if I was going to get another one, I would get the mm, either the meatball or the steak and cheese myself. Those are the ones I like the most. And I'd have to get them like with double meat because they didn't have a whole lot in them. Anyways, like, subscribe. Uh, any other ideas for things you want me to try? Comment below. I try to get to them. And yeah.